Our weed of the week is toothed spurge. Now, Darren, when you were a young agronomist, this is one of the weeds you what talked you to me I am, about. I am a young <laughs> oh, agronomist, oh, yeah, man. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, good, good all point. Right, all right, so when we're thinking about <laughs> tooth spurge, here's, here's one of the identifying features. Just break the stem. It's got milk in it. So that doesn't happen very often. There aren't too many weeds like that. So that gives you one idea of, hey, I might have tooth spurge here. Now, when you also think about tooth spurge, Roundup doesn't do a good job on it. So we often see this in fields where a farmer just sprayed a low rate of Roundup and he said, you know, I did pretty good, except for this weed, it's tooth spurge. Yep, and that's usually where we got the phone calls. So what did we have to go out there with? In soybeans is where we typically are going to see this problem. And post-emerge, now we've got 2,4-D tolerant soybeans, dicamba tolerant soybeans, liberty tolerant soybeans. All those things can work fairly well. Uh, we used to use Bassagran. Uh, Pursuit had some well, activity. I, I look at it this way, Brian. We didn't used to fight this weed back in the 70s and 80s. So the things that we were doing back in those days yep. were working really well. We really started seeing this as a problem in the late 1990s into the early 2000s when everybody was just spraying Roundup. So look at some of those older chemistries. We sprayed a lot of Bucktrol back in those days. Uh, we, Wait, we've that's got for many corn. Yeah, let's not jump around here. Let's stay on the soybean thing real quick. We suggest using the three pre's, a yellow, Metribuzin, and a PPO like Valor or Authority. Then you get to corn. Yes, Bucktrol, Status, the HPPDs. I mean, there are a lot of things that can work there. Pre-emerge, I'd suggest getting something out with Sharpen. Uh, maybe Verdict would be a pretty good choice. Yeah, and wheat, it's sharpened down, it's husky over the top, and you won't see tooth spurge. Well, that's it for our Weed of the Week, but stay tuned, Iron Talk is coming up next.